my beautiful beautiful people it has been a minute i mean oh my god it's a new year kwanza let me start by saying happy new year to you the new year has come new beginnings new realizations new dreams new vibes happy new year to you my family i pray that your new year will be filled with nothing but joy love hope and the fulfillment of your dreams you know thank you so so much for the support that you guys have given me since last year when we started and now we are still growing and and you know we are just happy that at least to live your dream and yet we to live so welcome back to another episode of my youtube channel if it is your first time to be here i am mudoni chemwile and this is being so a platform full of nothing but positivity positive vibes everything good that you can think of when the new year came nilikuwa tuna ziambia all i want this new year is nothing less than positive vibes you know and we are just optimistic that you know what we shall achieve our dreams the dreams the goals that we have set each and every morning when we wake up unajua unajipatia hiyo nguvu unajiambia nitafika and no matter how hard inakuwa you know tutafika tu tuna hustle tutafika hapo of course ukiweka Mungu mbele tutafika unajua mimi what i told myself when the new year started nilijiambia i want this year to be an adventurous year for me now I just want to travel on a budget. I believe I talk on a, a small budget, you can still travel, you can see go, you can still go and check um what Nairobi has in store for us, what Kenya has in store for us. And as we see, tunaanza pole pole. We are appreciating the growth process. Na imagine tutafika hapo tu. So anyway, please make sure you subscribe, drop a comment of um how you see ama how you find my content na leo pia we are going to travel and see uh this place called the Nairobi Safari Walk <laughs> funny enough as old as i am cj fika Nairobi Safari Walk and you know i was just sitting down and realizing by the way easy places ndogo ndogo zini tumekuwa tukiassume hizo ndo places that jay fika so mimi nikajiambia why not started why not start with these small small places alafu as we go on tunafanya nini tuna group i was um I was checking some reviews uh, kwa internet and they were saying that the place is kind of um, messy some animals were um, not in a good state and all that so I want to go and check out and um review the place for you guys if at all you want to go there this new year at least tutakuwa na an upper hand information of how the place look, looks like so please come along alafu tuende ni tuone how this place will be So Nairobi Safari Walk ndio bado Nairobi National Park ndio bado Nairobi orphanage Oh okay. Ati, what is your name Fred Makam <laughs> Fred Makam Oh nice to meet you too Walking in the park mm -hmm. Rules ni no walking in the park Picnic uh -huh. side uh -huh. No feeding the animals uh -huh. No driving off road uh -huh. No eating or making any kind of noise uh -huh. No throwing a stone to the animal. Uh -huh. No provoking the. Oh, no, I'm sorry. No, you are allowed to give way to the animals while crossing the road. Uh -huh. No littering the park. Uh -huh. People are not allowed. Uh -huh. Cigarette smoking only done at the picnic site. Uh -huh. Also, there's a picnic site, yeah. yeah. Drone cameras not allowed uh -huh. unless if you've paid for the reservist fee. Uh -huh. So those are the major rules. If you just observe them, we leave the park very keenly. Okay. Second information, Nairobi National Park is the oldest park in Kenya. The oldest, yeah? Yeah, it uh -huh. was established in 1946. Uh-huh. And uh, is the third smallest park uh -huh. in Kenya with a size of 117 square kilometer. Okay. The only park found within the city in the whole world. Eish. Yeah. Will you know you? I think it's, it's the, the only actually. park for within the city in the whole world. Wow. So those are, are some of the advantages. You need belt, isn't it? You need belt, yeah. I need to tie it at the back. Last time, we were going to work. 
na kwanga kuanzia May. May. Eh, May akuna hata guide anataka kupata pack chini ya 3500. Ah. Yeah. Na three, two hours 30 minutes fixed. Mhm. Oh. Now. Oh, fixed so mtu anafaa kuzunguka hii pack for 2 hours 30 minutes urudi. Yeah, that's the the time when you have the guide. If you when you have a guide, guide uh-huh. you do it up to 6. Oh. After 6 you're not expected to be in the pack. Also, mtu anaweza kuja tu peke yake. No, you can come by yourself. But the okay. challenge. Uh-huh. Sometimes for example like right now that man was that mother. Mm-hmm. She has told me that the rhinos are at number 25. Mm-hmm. Do you know that number 25? You don't know. Then you have oh, yeah. a guide you go there directly like now yes. we want to go there. Uh, Ebu tell us about the nini? The, If you want to hire that public van. The big cars. Yes, the big cars. If you want to hire the big cars one we have the one for 500 to 10,000. This one they are private cars. The car, sometimes the car is not belonging to you it's for someone else so you find that there is agreement between you and that person so there is a crocodile there lakini atushu, aturusi Adi kushuka hadi hippos oh hippos wow okay crocodile inakulanga nini inakulanga flesh si nakulanga flesh they flesh eaters but they don't feed on birds ah. because there is a there is a way they are benefiting from the birds how Crocodiles they have tank but dormant. Uh-huh. So you find that after they have fed on the flesh, uh-huh. you know the flesh elements will stick on their teeth. Oh yeah. And since the tank cannot roll and remove uh-huh. the flesh elements, they will come lie while their mouth is open then from there the bird will come and feed. I never knew crocodiles they normally zina said yango na birds to feed. That is something new I have learned today. Hey Shingo. They are called Shingo. Uskiri anasema tu Shingo. Huni mdogo sana. Kuna mrefu. Ah, ni Ah, kama ingia na nilikuwa namtafuta. So these are female. So hizi ni female eh? Yeah. Apart from tuangalia vizuri. Wanajua wapo kuona giraffe na zebra mbaya sana. Mbona huyu kameingia na nilikuwa na kalikuwa tu hapa? Na sasa ni kuulize I have a question though. Is it giraffe kwa sababu gestation period yake bado ni 9 months. Eh. Eh kuna Wow. But it's just you're not giraffe. The gestation period is 14 to 16 months. Ah. Uh, na so giraffe uh-huh. inaza kama inasimama. They give birth while standing and they must give birth on a hard ground. I saw I saw one being born at Toka and I'm going to catch him even and I'm going to hear the four years old. Why? I'm going to the four years old and I'm going to look at him and I'm going to look at him. Guys, you for you know I'm a muka. Uh-huh. I'm not going to answer. Ni give birth to twins. Uh-huh. Wakati na za. Uh-huh. There must be at the giraffe's surrounding that place for body is Okay. Ati kuna simba wakachoka, yena wakakula wakachoka. Ilikuwa ilikuwa mzee mkubwa. Yena wakakula wakachoka. So kwa iliuliwa aje na hizo kwa ile mti unaona kwa hii ni kichaka. Uh-huh. Alikuwa anakula hapo. Uh-huh. Simba ika kuja tu ikastock ikastock. Okay, this is the dead giraffe. Oi. And that is the family there. They've come to mourn the death of their relative. <laughs> Doizo doizo ni oh yeah ndio yo mama baba oh ndio ile sister ma oh yeah they killed the daddy and these giraffes have come to do the last visit come like okay This is interesting. I just can't believe it. So these giraffes are actually going to mourn the death of their, of their fellow. I think me all did. Now these are the stories we used to learn kwa the story book unasikia ati moja ilikufa asubuhi wakaamka wakaenda there they go. Oh my god. Oh, uni kijana. <laughs> This is the sun. Then they have another one there. Kenya, 
wildlife service. Main reception Dovu Court. Mm. Yeah, wildlife research. Keep right, keep right, new go. Ah, what are you see round about? Oh my god. Say hi to my people. Hello. <laughs> Classrooms. <sighs> what? I will first we look for the washrooms. Jumimi. <laughs> eh, Madarasa animal exhibits. Oh. Wow, anyone? Zina cohabitate. I'm going to visit Caribia. So guys, this is the monkey monkey. And the, you need what to go money? Eh? Ni hippo? Do you mali safi part two? This of the Shavana. In part two. <laughs> part two of the safari. But one to Mesha Malizo. This is the Nairobi Safari Walk. Papa. Do not feed the animal. This is a monkey monkey. <gasps> oh, can I end up? But that is it. Oh my god. Constant reminder please do not feed the animals. Wow. Eh, hey, Akanika Supu. If you need to talk to someone, you come and solve your issues at Safari Walk. Wow. I think Hindu is a good one. Because you can't see it anywhere. Guys, this is. Ini? Rhino. <laughs> Rhino. Ni seme nilifika kwa Rhino. There it is. Mele, pale, pale. And it's just... Eh, pia uku ni therapeutic, aki? I feel it's just therapeutic. Unakuja ku... Kutua... Stress. And imagine it's only 20 book. Ile inenda wapi? Na utukipotele uko ndani? Tuenda na hii kwanza, sindio? Let's go with this one first because Mimi na kupotea. Yeah, one hmm. I'm one and the same, I tell you. Leo to Japotea, Sana, to repeat a book. Leo Pian, you guys, Leo Pian, me potea. So, Kupotea, Kupotea, and me are one and the same thing. Well, we can follow this Sehemu Zanika Savannah Habitat. Mm hmm. Yeah, me too. Who are you? Where? Eh, hey, guys, we saw a tortoise. Toto is a many tortoise. It's a tortoise. This is a tortoise. Na imenda kichwa yake imenda chini. Imengiza kichwa down. Hello. Oh. And then. Kai izi miguzake zinaka scary, zinaka old. <laughs> so guys, we want to take a, a video of this tortoise summer's journey tortoise while moving, and we want to go as slow as possible so that. <laughs> ah, damn it! Aki merudisha kichwa. Hmm. 
Na basa there. Oh, Mm. Let's go and take pictures. Wow. But I think the the basic thing about this place is just the environment. Did we pass there? No, we did not. You sure? I don't know. Papa ni muisho. Si muisho. Aki si tunashina tu kipote ya kaseli. Iko api? Wow. That is a crocodile.